Hello everyone. Today I will show you how to create your own icon. So let's begin. First open Photoshop and click on the file, then new. Now name your project, then type the dimensions and resolution as same as they are on the screen. And at the end click on OK. Now you can use your imagination to create an any kind of icon. I literally mean whatever you want. I will create an icon for a folder with my personal stuff, so I will just type on the image PS. So go and choose a text tool and type PS. After you type it, modify the font with options above. Watch the demonstration. Whenever you want to confirm changes, click on Enter. And when you want to adjust text again, just double click on the text thumbnail. For more options to adjust text, click on the icon above. When you finish with adjusting, just click the Enter key to confirm the changes. Now let's change the background color. Double click on the layer with white color to unlock it. Then click on Paint Bucket Tool. Choose the random color below and simply click on the working area. Then double click on the text thumbnail and change the color of the text. Now let's create a diagonal line. Simply create a new layer. Choose a polygonal lasso tool. And use all of your talent and draw a diagonal line. If you want a straight line, just hold a shift button while dragging the line. And at the end, when you want to close the selection, just bring the cursor close to the last angle, and the cursor type will change, then just click with mouse button. Now adjust the selection, then choose the color of your line, and simply click in the selection with a bucket tool, you will have to have the empty layer chosen. After that let's modify the line, click on select, modify and feather. When you accomplish that, click on select and inverse and simply click on delete key. And you can see you have feathered the line. Now click on select, then deselect and go to the layer where you have a line created. Click on it with right mouse button and select create clipping mask. Then adjust the position of the line. Now let's change the background color again. After that let's add a stroke and bevel and emboss to a text. Just play with the settings.
And we are done. Now click on File. Save as. Choose a name and format and click on Save. By the way, if you want to create just a text icon, delete the background, and here choose the .png format, and continue with the same steps. Here just select the best quality, and click on OK. Now, close the Photoshop, and go to the following website, here you will convert your image to a .ico format which is required for icons. So first upload your image. Then select the .ico format. At the end just download it on your computer. Now return on your desktop, and let's demonstrate how to apply an icon to a folder. Watch the demonstration. And that is all. Thanks for watching, and have a nice day. Bye.